2019 has seen major milestone in Myanmar telecom sector. The first thing is the new telecommunication law, which releases 1885 Myanmar Telegraphy Act and 1934 Myanmar Wireless Telegraphy Act. That is enacted in this year, 2013. And the next thing is uh, the two new integrated the, 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 the nationwide telecommunication license data process. It was started in January 2013 and successfully completed on 38 January 2014 with the two winners that you know, Telenor Myanmar Limited and Oridium Myanmar Limited, and both accepting uh, license terms. Uh, for all the policy and regulatory frameworks, we still need to develop uh, there's some frameworks under the telecoms law. We have to make sure that connectivity reaches to the rural and remote areas in our country. We have uh, uh, reduced the gap between the urban and rural areas development. And another thing is the job opportunities. Uh, for for, for the, the, the international operators, uh, they, uh, some operators have uh, commitment to recruit about 90 percent of the employees may be the Myanmar citizen after five years. So a lot of Myanmar citizens will uh, get a new job. And for the technology transfer, we have, compared to the other countries in our region, we have very huge gap, especially for the telecom sector. Now we have, uh, I think we have the great opportunity to leapfrog. We have a lot of the, the new technology for the telecom and related related, related ICT uh, the sector. There are challenges, of course, but we have come through them quite efficiently. Uh, we will continue to ensure fair competition and consumer protection. Telecoms and ICT development can contribute significantly uh, in the social and economic development. It is a key driver for inclusive national development. So it is our ministry's vision to make telecoms and ICT an engine for inclusive national development. The licensee structure in the telecommunication law enables the huge opportunities for the investment. Infrastructure development is uh, an important area, uh, fiber, tower, and uh, related the network facilities need to be developed quickly. Uh, besides telecom, uh, related ICT services such as mobile financial services, e-government and e-commerce sector uh, will be the other areas of the interest. We are uh, creating an investment-friendly policy and regulatory framework. I would like to invite everyone all over the world to look into Myanmar as both a potential partner and destination for business. And Myanmar is making positive changes in all aspects of governance and business. See for yourself. Our doors are open. <laughs>